In this video, we will demonstrate the dissolution of uranium metal in acid. We will then go over the process of preparing urinal nitrate before demonstrating a separation with the acidic organic extractant, tributyl phosphate. Before beginning, we would like to note that the identity of the uranium sample used here is unknown. It is possibly uranium metal, uranium dioxide, or a combination of the two. The identity will be verified as the experiment progresses. To start, we place the uranium sample in an Erlenmeyer flask and add about 30 milliliters of 6.5 molar hydrochloric acid to dissolve. Here we can see that the solution turns a dark gray, green color. However, the dissolution was incomplete. This is evidence that the sample contains uranium dioxide, as it dissolves less readily than pure uranium metal and hydrochloric acid. To completely dissolve the sample, 8 molar nitric acid was added to the flask and the solution was heated at about 90 degrees Celsius. The color change from dark green to bright yellow indicates the uranium has gone from the 4 plus oxidation state to the 6 plus oxidation state, producing urinal nitrate. Once the sample has reached this yellow color, the flask can be removed from the heat and allowed to cool. A portion of the cooled urinal nitrate was added to a glass centrifuge tube with 30% tributyl phosphate and dodecane. The tube was inverted several times to mix the solutions, forming an emulsion. Upon settling, the two phases separate completely. This process, called solvent extraction, selectively removes uranium from the solution, leaving all the impurities behind. Using a pipette, the organic layer was removed and transferred to a separate centrifuge tube containing 0.01 molar nitric acid. Once again, the tube was inverted to mix the solutions, and upon settling, the two phases separate completely. The uranium was removed from the organic phase, while all possible impurities remain in the original aqueous solution. That concludes the demonstration of the dissolution of uranium metal and acid.